Well, you've reached the end of Song Station. Congratulations if you made it this far. We took you from the very beginning. You learned how to harmonize melodies. You learned how to hear the melody, determine it, notice whether it's going up or down, how to put the very basic major and minor chords behind the melody. But then we quickly took you over the bridge and taught you the difference between just harmonizing the melody and then transferring to this idea of following the left hand and really doing chord progressions and knowing what leads to what and what pulls and pushes to what. And understanding that allows you to put together the bigger chord progression. So you don't always have to go from the one to the five. You can go from the one to the two to the five or the one to the six to the two to the five. As long as you start and stop where you need to go, you can put all the secondary chords and movements and progressions that you want. And I hope that's clear. And in the second half, we just let JP loose and he ripped through a number of advanced chords and movements. Don't think that you have to learn those. That's more like a bonus section for our advanced folks. We promise you that you'd be blown away with some fancier things to do. So if you're a beginner and you were intimidated by that, don't worry about that. Just get the first part down, learn how to use melodies and harmonizing chords, and really learn the system. Try to find a melody to your favorite song or another hymn or congregational song, and then use those same chords that we covered. This then take those chords to another key. It's the same thing. You move it up to D and it'll be the, the D flat major chord. It'll be a D major chord now. You just move up to the new scale, keeping the same chords in alignment, but just move up your fingers and now you got the harmonization scale for D. Then do it to E flat. Then do it to E. And soon you have all 12 keys mastered. So that's the idea. Learn the harmony, learn the cadences, learn the progressions and the patterns, and then you add fancy stuff that you can pull out your toolkit whenever you want. So thank you for stopping by Song Station. You got Fundamental Factory, you got Chord County, Pattern Paradise, now Song Station. And stay tuned for other DVDs in the series like Ear Elevator and some of the bonus things. You want to log in the Gospel Music Training Center because if you like some of the stuff you learn, that is what the Gospel Music Training Center is all about teaching you how to apply all this stuff that we've been doing in Musician Transformation. So if you want application in real life songs and settings, you gotta log into this club and become a member, stay a member, stay in there and live in there because it really is that important. There's a lot of stuff in there for you to learn. So I'm Jermaine Griggs and on behalf of Jonathan Powell and Hearing Play, I'd like to wish you all the best. I'm Jermaine Griggs and remember, if you can hear it, you can play it.